It is one of the most scandalous royal love stories of all time, and many people still don't entirely know how to feel about it. Prince Charles has been married to Camilla Parker Bowles since 2005, but many royal fans still can't shake the deep-seated feeling that their illicit love affair is what drove Princess Diana to her untimely demise. Bowles, in particular, has never been able to rise to the level of popularity that many royal family members have, and is continuously the subject of tabloid headlines and speculation. Prince Charles and Camilla Parker Bowles' relationship history Charles met Camilla in 1971 and they reportedly fell for each other right away. They dated for a short time, but when Charles started serving in the Royal Navy, their relationship was derailed. With Charles away, she started dating Andrew Parker Bowles and ultimately married him in 1973. In spite of the fact that she was married to someone else, Camilla stayed in contact with Charles, even after he married Diana Spencer in 1981. Camilla went on to divorce her then-husband, Andrew, and it is said her affair with Charles began, in earnest, after her divorce. Of course, it is now, public knowledge that Diana knew of Charles and Camilla's relationship, and that it gave her serious issues with depression. It is Charles's affair with his old flame that ultimately contributed to his divorce from Diana. The stigma of the affair caused Charles and Camilla to keep their relationship lucky for years after Diana's death. Of course, they did eventually went public and tied the knot in 2005, making Camilla the Duchess of Cornwall. What does the Queen think of Camilla Parker Bowles? Ever since the relationship was revealed, the tabloids have been reporting that Queen Elizabeth hates Camilla, and has even ordered her son to divorce his wife. However, the truth seems to be quite far from this and it seems to be that the Queen has accepted Camilla as her son's true love, even if their relationship has caused some raised eyebrows along the way. In addition to her friendly relationship with the Queen, Camilla is said to get along quite well with Princes William and Harry, and has been seen in photographs chatting warmly with Meghan Markle, Harry's wife. Does the public want to see them divorced? While the Queen might be fond of Camilla, the same cannot be said for the majority of the public. Royal fans all over the world still hold on to a deep affection for Diana, even though she has been gone for many years. Many people still hold the point of view that Camilla was personally responsible for the dissolution of Charles and Diana's marriage, even though Charles shared equal involvement for their alleged affair. It is even possible that a good many people would like to see her well away from the royal family entirely by divorcing Charles. The line of succession has Prince Charles taking the throne after his mother, Queen Elizabeth, which would make Camilla his queen. This idea doesn't seem to sit well with the British public. Recently, there was a poll which put forth the idea of Camilla becoming Queen Consort. Oh, 3,000 of the 4,000 people polled were not comfortable with the idea of Camilla becoming Queen, a staggering number indeed. Whether or not Camilla ever does become Queen remains to be seen. It seems that the public's idea of her is somewhat established regardless of the reality of the situation, and is unlikely to change anytime soon.